Hello everyone, it's LPS Baja, and I'm coming to you today with my first ever video. I really am sorry for that background noise. My room has a huge aquarium in it, and until I get my spare room all cleaned up, this is where I'll record for now. But I guess I deserve a break since I'm brand new to YouTube. Now today I am here doing an unboxing video. Yes. Um, actually first let's go into a little bit of details about myself. Um, years ago, about five, I was nine years old, ten, and I was a Littlest Pet Shop YouTuber. Um, back when you actually could have usernames as all one name. Um, uh, then I kind of just, after the new generation of pets come out, you know, the very ugly ones that come out after the ones that you're looking at right now, which is me. Um, I kind of lost interest. I had no use for them. They were extremely unattractive to me and I just I just dropped it and sold all my pets. I had about 300. I was the talk of the little sketch up town, obsessed with it and everything. Um, until recently, uh, I discovered the new pets and I started watching little sketch up YouTubers again and I was like, okay, I need to start again. This is like they're they're back and they're better than ever of course you can never top the originals but these pets are so adorable and the accessories are so adorable so it's time to rekindle my love for those pet shops and start fresh now originally i did keep some pets because i do a customizing thing where i am inspired by a youtuber called pink bunny girl 43 in her custom uh, Littlest Pet Shops and I'll show you a couple of what I do right now. Okay, so these are a couple of my most recent works. Um, they are actually some original characters of mine. I'm actually in the artist community, but yeah, they're just painted, uh, all done by me. And this is what kept me in the fandom, I guess, because without these I wouldn't be part of the fandom still and they're just what really kept me holding on. Uh, these, this one here was actually made out of a G2, uh, G5 Series 2 pet. So yeah, something that I kept close to my heart always since I was a little girl. Now that I feel like we know each other a little bit better, um, I hope that you, everyone will welcome me to YouTube with open arms and, um, will welcome my fingernails as the ugliest ones on YouTube. I can't paint them. I work in a restaurant. I am sorry. Let's just get to the unboxing. Okay, so what we have here is the Littlest Pet Shop Snowboarding Kitty Crew. <laughs> I'm so self-conscious about my fingernails right now. Anyway, so basically this is a super cute family of kitties. There is one uh, mini pet, two teeny pets, one is a mystery, and two regular size pets. And they're, both, they're all kitties, my favorite. So here's another picture and a couple other sets. Oh my goodness, I need that one. The hippo is so cute. So is the hamster. I just love them all. Okay. I really like this one. This one kind of looks like the Brooke LPS from LPS Popular before she got... <laughs> before it hit series 2, I guess. Anyway, let's open it up. Okay, so... I have it all out of the box here, and first we're going to start with the daddy kitty. Okay, so here he is. Okay, so he's this super duper cute purple kitty. He's got a really long tail and bangs and oh my goodness, that fluffy chest, blue eyes and a button pink nose. Oh, I love the flexibility of the heads of these new thighs. Um, super cute. 
by fives, I mean generation five. Love it. Yeah, he's super cute. Next we have the mommy. Comes right out of there, smooth as butter. Okay, so this mommy is adorable. She has a little, like, mine has a little nick in the side of the face. I don't know if you can see it, but she's kind of damaged. Anyway, no flaws. Uh, no matter, I mean. Yeah, she's super cute. Let's give a little turn around. Love her. I don't know why she's so greasy. My hands are not greasy. She's just, just like that. I love the little curly upwards tail. And I love how they're different molds. Like these two cats are not the same mold. Love it. Um, the scarf does come off. So here's what she looks like without her scarf. She is fierce. I love the scarf. I wonder if it goes on the daddy. It does, and I love that with his palette. And it's not just for those series of pets, too. It would also go on my mascot just fine if I could work my fingers right. Yeah, that's super duper cute and great for uh, Christmas videos. Alright, up next it looks like we have the big sister right out of there she comes right out like it's nothing my whole scene is falling apart okay so here she is oh um there's not a lot of flexibility in the head if you wanted to just do it like that that would work as well um really really cute if you're doing like a video and you need like a little sibling super cute i love it it reminds me just of my kitty uh, my cat Sanders looks just like this, and I love it. It's so, so cute. Next, we have the little sister. It's just kind of difficult to pop out of there. Um, yeah, I'm going to pop her out. She did not want to pop out of there, but here she is. She is super duper cute. I love it. I love just the basic color scheme and the uh, black eyes. Very, very cute. Um, if it would focus on her and not everyone in the back, that would be great. <laughs> so, here she is. There is minimal details. Like, they could have added, like, the little pink nose. That would have been really cute. But, yeah, she looks great alongside the rest of the family. And the last pet is actually a mystery pet. So, let's get it out of that mystery box. Okay. First thing you see is the little kitty. <laughs> Let's take a peek. Okay, so here is our little mystery pet. And he is so adorable. He looks like the troublemaker little brother. And look at that face. That mold is just so cute. <laughs> Don't mind my nails again. Anyway, that mold is just so cute. And he looks like, oh, of course. Um, he looks like you don't want to mess with him. And he would be super cute as uh, a little star in a video. Love him. He's adorable. And next to the rest of the family, he fits right in. Um, other than that, he's a little dirty. But that's painted on. As you can see, I don't quite understand that. But it's cute, whatever. So, <laughs> love it. Now on to the accessories. Right, so we're now on to the accessories and oh my gosh guys, this is super cute and fun in winter themes and I love it. And in Canada right now where I live, it is actually super duper snowy. Like the ground is covered in snow and it's only November. So um, I'm not really a big snow fan, but I love how aesthetic it is. You know what I mean? Anyway, let's get right to them. Okay, so first, we have this little snowball. It is like a transparent and almost hot glue looking snowball. Um, super cute. Looks adorable. Next, we have a little, oh, <laughs> a little fish and it is so cute. Look at that, oh my goodness. 
Looks like something you could like ice fish in. Or four, I should say. Adorable. And we all know kitties love fish. Or at least they do in this <laughs> set. Um, and this is what looks to be a selfie stick. Yeah, I would say that's a selfie stick. Cute, cute. Little four on it. Um, the back is really detailed and cute. I do wish they would use some different colors for their accessories rather than just one solid. Um, and then we have a little snowboard. Please focus. <laughs> anyway, look at the detailing on that. It's so cute. Oh. So yeah, there is the accessories, not including mommy's collar. So let's see what we look like all decked out. Walking in a winter wonderland. <laughs> this set is so cute. I love it and I love these new pets and I'm so happy that these were my first addition to my semi-new collection. Of course I have uh, a couple other Great Danes that I still kept, but this is my first addition to my new collection besides them. And I'm so happy that these were the ones that I picked. My mother actually picked them out for me, so I'm glad these were the ones she picked. Um, even though I'd probably be happy with anything else because these new pets are adorable. So yeah, um, aren't they just the cutest? I really hope you guys liked everything in this video. Um, like I said, I am new so there is flaws, like I need a better mic. Um, I am recording this on my phone using Video Effects Live, so clearly there is some issues there. Um, my audio is bad, my nails are awful, as I've been saying throughout the whole video, but anyway, um, thank you guys for watching, and like and subscribe to see more from me, and there will be baby, I am back! and better than ever, hopefully, and back with these cute new LPS. Aren't they just the cutest? I love them. Thank you guys so much for watching. Um, yeah, I'll see you all in the next video. Bye!